when you actually go out in nature and you detach from technology a little bit, I think it allows you to more easily become attuned to your body, to be able to listen to your body. Our phones are constantly in our hands and when you break away from that, you breathe fully and your mind clears and you don't feel that pressure of the rat race and looking to get people's approval or doing well at work, all of the stress, the emails, all the things that need to be taken care of around the house. You get to step away from all of that and breathe a little. There is no more fulfilling thing than to see something that only a handful of people ever go see. It's not because they can't get to it, because a lot of these places are actually really, really easily accessible. always encouraging our audience to listen to their bodies and the truth is you have to do the same with your mind you have to take care of your mind too you have to think of the entire package we tell people to remember to breathe not to hold their breath and this is the equivalent of letting your mind breathe sunsets have you missed or just kind of caught a glimpse of and like yeah whatever whereas standing on the edge of that bridge you are towering over this incredibly tumultuous water look at the, the sun that's out in front of you and how quickly it actually moves i've always felt like sunsets are kind of like the thumbprint of the day like they're all different i definitely don't have time to do it every day but every time i do it i feel like i've done something right that i've slowed life down enough to be able to watch the sun go down.